Bonjour tout le monde, hi everyone, welcome back on my channel, it's me Max and today I'm gonna react to a new song from Yorgen22 with Ukraine. So I uh of course, you all know what is happening right now in Ukraine, and if you don't know, please check the news. I had down a reaction before uh, about the official song where I was really enthusiastic and really positive about the song, but I didn't feel okay to publish it due to the current event that is happening right now in Ukraine. But I, I still think that it's important to publish this reaction because we need to hear this Ukrainian culture, this Ukrainian music and artists. This is really important. And I know there are a lot of Ukrainian fans which are watching this channel. You're like the third country who's watching the most my channel. So I, I know how many you are. And I just hope that right now you are first of all safe that you are okay and not alone. We heard you, we stand with you, Ukraine, Slava Ukraini. If you want to be helpful as you can as a citizen like me in your country, please check if there are protests in your city, check if there are a collect to help humanitarian organization, and you can also donate to this humanitarian organization. And please, if there are some of you which have official lines where we can donate, please tell me in the comment section, I will publish the lines in my description video. So, we're gonna do this reaction and we'll be neutral, but now let's just react to Okay, let's go with Kalush Orchestra and their song Stefania. Kalush, Kalush. The public is really happy and screams their names, I like it. I really love this introduction, this just take her attention as a TV viewer uh, in the audience, so that's really great. And then we have this, a rap part is speaking so quickly, this is really efficient, I like it, and really impressive. Love the outfit too. It's a bit modern, but it's in the same time traditional. La, li, la, li. And this, I love the chorus. This is really a great song. I like it. It brings this rap and urban sound with this amazing chorus, which is really modern. Love it. And then we have this flautist. I like it a lot. That's fantastic for me. Traditional, modern, what Ukraine can do the best. About the lyrics, I check the translation. I really like it, honestly. It's like the music, it's modern with, it's like past with a future and now moment. They are talking about their mothers, how oh, they feel safe with them. And then this idea, le la bé, la, le la, which mean uh, berceuse in French for the French speakers. Oh, mama. So I, I like to have this uh, a song which is like an homage and, and just thanks to, to your mother. And, and that just celebrates, you know, your mother and amazing woman that they are. They have this clapping moment, which is really efficient also, because the public is with you. They really embrace the public and the audience. I like it a lot. That's... For me, that's fantastic. I... I... Hey! This is so good! Uh, uh, uh. You want to dance, but you understand the message also. And fantastic. Masterpiece, maybe for me. This is Ukraine. So that was my reaction to the song Stefania from Carlos Orchestra. I I really appreciate it, honestly. It's a mix which is so interesting. I really appreciate every time this traditional element from Ukrainian culture, which is fantastic in the music. It's not the first time that Ukraine does it, uh, and that this is the best thing they're doing in Eurovision, to, to bring traditional elements with music and modern sound. And the mix between the two music genres are fantastic for me. And 
this just embraced Ukrainian culture and just because of the song I could see them being back in the top five again in the top ten I don't know but the song is really strong uh, the public and the audience love it and, and I'm sure that a lot of Eurovision fans are gonna love it too they largely win the televote in the Ukrainian uh, selection so that's great uh, of course there have been this story about Alina Pasha I don't want to talk about it because I think we just need to be united right now for me the song is just great I, I'm just I'm appreciate the song. I'm listening a lot to the song right now and I don't know if I feel the message or not but I definitely appreciate the message and I definitely appreciate uh, the cultural thing that are being put on the stage and in this music. So congrats Carlos Orchestra. I can't wait to see you at Eurovision 2022. I think it is really important to see Ukraine this year at Eurovision of course and Yes, Slava Ukraini and good luck for Eurovision. What do you think of the song Tamien? Mean, we think the comment section and please be respectful, kind and supportive to Ukrainian fans which are watching and reading the comment section of course. I will see you really soon for a new video. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on my social networks. Bye bye, au revoir, see you soon, à bientôt.